Hey guys, I wanted to come at you guys with, um, for you guys to see how my hair looks before I flat iron it and stuff like that. So this is my hair. My hair doesn't look that bad. The top part, I relaxed my hair maybe two months ago or so. I relaxed the top part of my hair. I didn't touch the bottom half. I just relaxed the top half of my hair. So this is what my hair looks like. Um before me flat earning it and stuff like that and what I did was um I mean I know it looks a little bit boofy but my hair is still shiny and it actually feels really really soft so my hair is actually really working like getting really good so I'm really excited about my hair my hair used to be like way more bigger and more like crazier looking and more dry looking after washing my hair I didn't put anything in my hair um yet I, all I did was um, after I washed it, like I, I liked it for it to be still wet, and, and add some heat protectant. And this is Tresemme's heat protectant, and I like this because um, what I do, because I know I see some people do it with dry hair already, and I feel like you're just re-wetting your hair. But a lot of people like to use it when they're blowing out the hair, so it kind of makes sense. But I do it when I just get out the shower, then I'll spray it and let it air dry because. Um, I like my hair to air dry because when I blow dry it, my hair, um, my scalp, not my hair, but my scalp gets really dry and I have psoriasis, so blowing out my hair doesn't really work for me. I have to make sure I have enough time to let it air dry. And my hair dries pretty quickly when I let it air dry. And um, so yeah, that's that. That's what I did. So that's the only thing that's in my hair right now. And yeah, so my hair has been doing pretty good. I know some people be like, girl, your hair is a poofy mess. But compared to what it looked like before, uh, my hair is actually really healthy looking right now. And I have been using the Indian hemp for a few, like two weeks now. And I really like this stuff. And I showed you guys before, like it has like um, the little seeds inside. Natural seeds. It smells really good. So yeah, that's what I've been using. I have been using too much stuff. And then, if I do blow out my hair, I use the Twisted Sister Blow Drying Cream. This stuff is really, really good for ethnic hair. I really like it. And um, it says relaxes, unwinds, and smooths, and moisturizes. So this stuff is actually really good. I hardly ever blow out my hair because it's just, I'm lazy and I don't like doing it. And <laughs> I just let my hair air dry. So right now I'm going to show you guys the difference, like how my hair looks before and after. And also I want to show you guys my bang length because um, I showed you guys my bang length, I think the beginning of November I showed you guys, ooh, I showed you guys the length of my bangs and I think they were like right here from right here. So now I want to show you guys what it looks like now in the end of January. And my bang is down here now. This is using Do Grow. So my bangs are down here. How cool is that? So now my bangs are down here. So in the uh, beginning of November, I showed you it was up here. And now it's down here. And before that, in the beginning of October, I cut it right here. So I went from here to here to here. That is super fast. Especially for ethnic hair. That is super duper fast for it to grow in, uh, what is that, three months? I want to say beginning of, no, 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 yeah, like beginning of September, I cut my hair right above my chin, and now my hair is down here, right here. So I just want to show you guys what I do with my um, iron. I, I know this is really messed up iron. I use it all the all the time. This is the one pass. Um, this is the downfall to having a white flat iron. It's just it starting to look like that, but the iron is still really good. This iron was about $120 for this. <laughs> and I got it on the one pass site. Um, I'll put the link down below if you guys are interested. I know it's weird like how I do it. I section off everything. I'm not gonna show you guys every single thing I'm doing. I'm just gonna show you the difference between my flat iron hair and how it looks before I flat iron it. So this is how it looks right now. You can see how it looks like that. It's just colored and everything because I had like different colors over the summer. But um I'm gonna take a piece and take my flat iron. And what I do is I focus it on the top part first and then go down real slow. And there you go.
difference. <laughs> See how shiny and nice it looks? It looks really good. So that's basically it. Um, it makes my hair look really shiny and really nice. So yeah, that's my hair. That's what I do. I don't put grease on it or anything uh, because I just think I don't have to put grease in it uh, because it's nice and shiny and it stays in its place. I only put grease like around my perimeter of the top of my hair and that's it. So yeah, I'll show you guys the um, the ending product after I'm done. Hey guys, so this is what my hair looks like now. It's, you can see it's like flatter now and shiny and stuff, it looks good. Um, really quickly, I just wanted to show you guys how I do my bangs. So what I do is I take all my bangs like in the front and I always do my bangs forward, like just flat iron it forward. Even though you're not wearing it, you know, down like that, just flat iron it forward. I actually even do this even if I'm in doing a middle part. So my hair does like a the Kim Kardashian bang type of flat iron and take some sections. And I randomly take sections and just do this like right here. Hopefully you guys can see. It looks really nice. I don't think I'm gonna wear my hair like that now. No, I feel like wearing my hair like let's see. Um I don't think I'm gonna do the side part. For some reason I feel like it doesn't look right on my side of the middle part. <laughs> I keep changing my mind up. I hope this was helpful. You guys got to see what my, you know, my hair looks in my natural in its natural state before I flat iron it and stuff, and just the tools that I used. And I don't know what's going on with the sun, but yeah, just showing you guys the tools that I use and stuff like that to get my hair to look like this because it doesn't naturally is not naturally like this. Um, you know, it isn't dry and end up like this. I wish, but um, yeah. So this is what it looks like. I hope you guys enjoy. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!